Hello viewers, welcome to Agile Math class. Today we will be solving this question on Olympiad. Yeah, before we proceed, if this is the first time of watching our videos, we say a very big thank you to you and please don't forget to subscribe. And to our returning viewers, thank you very much. Yeah, today we have the 147 raised to power x equals 189. Then look for what is the value of 7 raised to power 1 minus 2x over 3 into bracket x minus 3. Now for us to do this, don't forget here we are having 147 and then 147 can be written as the multiple of what? 49 and 3. So our 49 can be written as 7 raised to power 2 multiplied by 3. Also, we have that 189 can be written in the form of 7 multiplied by 27. And 27 also can be written in the form of what? 3 raised to power 3. Now, having known this, we are coming back to this. And um, from here... So our 147 can be written in this form of 7 raised to power 2 multiplied by 3 all raised to power x equals 189 can be written as 7 multiplied by 3 raised to power 3. So now we're writing this, we know from the rule of indices that if you have x y raised to power a is the same as saying s raised to power a multiplied by y raised to power a. So adopting the same method to solve this further, we have 7 raised to power 2x multiplied by 3 raised to power x, which is equal to 7 multiplied by 3 raised to power 3. Okay, solving further now. This is almost the same thing as having 7 raised to power 1, okay? 7 raised to power 1 is equivalent to 7. Now, we intend to um, make the 7s to be on one side and the 3s to be on the other side. So, we can do that by dividing both sides by 7 raised to power 2x multiplied by 3 raised to power 3. 7 raised to power 2x multiplied by 3 raised to power 3. Okay, so this can possibly cancel out. Also, this can cancel out. So, at the left hand side, we are having 3 raised to power x divided by 3 raised to power 3 equal 7 raised to power 1 divided by 7 raised to power 2x. Now, using the method of indices again that we have when s raised to power a over s raised to power b, the division rule. We are going to have s raised to power a minus b. You can check some of our videos on indices. Now, at the left hand side here, we are having 3 raised to power x minus 3 equals 7 raised to power 1 minus 2x. Now, in order to simplify this further, multiply the root of both sides by 1 over 3, x minus 3. 1 over x minus 3. So here x minus 3 can cancel out. Oh, okay. okay. Let's proceed with this. We are having 3 on this side equal 7 raised to power 1 minus 2x over x minus 3. So we want to multiply the root of both sides by 1 over 3 again. 1 over 1 over 3, yeah. So here we are going to have, at the left hand side here, we are having the cube root of 3. equal 7 raised to power 1 minus 2x all over 3 into bracket x minus 3. Now looking at this, 
and this, you can see that this corresponds with what we have here. So that means the value of this is the same as square root of 3. So finally, coming back here, we can say that this is equal to what? Keep roots. From here, it should be the keep root of 3. So this is equivalent to the what? The keep root of 3. Or we can say that it's equal to 3 raised to power 1 over 3. Thank you very much for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you next video. Thank you.